Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play The Long Dark. My name is Weasel, and we are in a little hut after we successfully fended off a wolf attack. I mean, condition 18% is not the best, but it's still better than being dead. Am I right? Yeah, Weasel, you're right. That's that's a pretty obvious one. You don't need to ask around for that. So, um, I'm just collecting whatever is here, cloth. Um, we might have to do some repairs, thanks to that stupid wolf. Uh, definitely gonna have, need some sleep, but for now I'm just gonna repair some stuff and sleep later. Um, I don't know what took damage. The can opener, definitely not. But the premium winter coat, we should repair that. Just, you know, to warm up and get rid of some cloth. Alright, that was wonderful. That did a trick. Um, I cannot repair my boots because I'm, you know, I'm out of leather. I'm a little thirsty, a little hungry. I think I'm just gonna sleep at this point. That should do the trick. Uh, let's put that up to... I guess we're just gonna sleep... We're gonna just gonna have to sleep six hours at least. Um, I don't wanna get it too late because I still wanna get out today. But if my condition is too bad, I'm just gonna sleep through the night. And uh, gonna have to... You know, gonna cost me a lot of food. Thirst, all right, uh, condition 51%. Ah, I don't feel comfortable with that. So I'm just gonna drink some water. Um, give me food and drink. Wait, and let's just drink that. It's gonna reduce our weight anyway, which is a good thing. And uh, yeah, let's sleep another, I'd say 10 hours or 12 hours. Yeah, let's 12 hours is fine. We're gonna be so hungry after this. And hopefully not frozen to death. I think we should be warm enough. All right, <laughs> I've survived two days, 11 hours, slept most of it, I'm dehydrated. Ah, let's uh, drink some condensed milk. Mmm, mm, mm, mm. It's good for the stomach. Okay, very well, and uh, we're gonna get that down. I'm just gonna drink through my sodas at this point. Effectively reducing our weight. Stacy's grape soda seems to be very popular around here. Good for them, or good for Stacy, considering that Stacy's selling all her, her soda. Um, okay, it's 542. Mm, let's drink one more. And I haven't looked at my condition actually, so let's quickly do that. Uh, it's 99%. Good. I have no weapon. I wish I had a rifle. I would have shot that wolf, even if I couldn't have got at him. But okay. Oh, come on. Waiting right at the door. I am a really lucky fellow. Okay. Let's just uh, hope that there's no wolf on the bridge. Like last time. And that the other wolf keeps his distance. Ah, there's a wolf. Ah, that's fantastic. I wonder if there's another way through here. I don't feel that there would be. Um, it's quite dark. It is quite cold. Okay, this wolf... Doesn't like me, okay. I am going to try to find my way through the forest here. Um, try to bypass that wolf. I don't think he's onto me, actually. But also, I don't see him. I don't know how good the AI is. Hopefully not too good. But I think I should be fine if I just squeeze my way around here. Oh, excuse me. Oh, it looks so cool. Um, all right. I think we passed him. He should be somewhere down here. It's hard to see. Yep, yeah, there he is. Okay. Let's just hope we don't find another one. Mm, where do I have to go? Oh, there's a path. Good. This should lead us to train tracks or something along those lines. It's still very, very early in the day, but I do enjoy to get a head start. I'm hearing crows. Hmm. So, over here, if I'm not mistaken, if I'm, you know, believing the map, there should be train tracks. Yes, there actually are train tracks. And over here should be a little hut. Yep, there's a little hut, the train unloading. Um, before I'm gonna go over, I'm actually going to look through that little hut. Big question is, how are we gonna, you know, fare? Are we just gonna try to survive as long as possible? 
Um, or are we going to continuously explore everything? I, I mean, both got, uh, um, does go hand in hand, but I could just try to, you know, survive for as long as possible in one location. And, uh, let's open that drawer. In one location, and then head out when I need more, you know, and just, you know, bunker everything in one house. Which I'm still considering doing. Uh, I am considering getting a house. Um, cumbered. Oh, firewood, okay. Let's have a quick look. How much am I carrying? 33. Um, let's drink a soda. And I think I'm just gonna put the firewood back down. Um, eh, let's put it in a drawer, whatever. Five kilograms. New sprint rolls. Sure, let's let's put down. Actually, I should probably do put down a little, maybe a few sodas. I have quite a few sodas. Um, four sodas. That's good. And where's my tinder plugs? Wood matches? No. Uh, give me wait. Uh, jerry can. Yeah, I think we could put down the jerry can as well. And the simple tools, maybe. Well, definitely put that over the firewood. Okay, so I'm just gonna remember that there's stuff in here. I think I've just been, you know, too carrying just way too much. Ah, oh, with no. Yeah, I've just been carrying way too much. There is definitely a strategy to carrying less, therefore you know be faster or you know using less calories. Also, being able you know to scavenge for stuff. That would still require me to have a home base, so I could, you know, gather stuff, bring it back to home base, and uh, then keep exploring. Okay, I think I see a wolf. Is that a wolf in the distance? It's hard to tell because there are only a few pixels, but I'm just curious. This might be the way to Mystery Lake. Is that a... Oh, yeah. That should be... An endless supply of water, shouldn't it be? I mean, it's a riverbed. Ah, a waterfall, a riverbed weasel. Really? How can you mix up those two words? That's those are quite different things. In any case, let's see if we are up oh, on the right path. Come on, no, don't do this to me. Okay, I thought I was stuck and I couldn't come back up, but we're good. Oh, this looks good. Please tell me this leads there. I see a big white wall. That would be great if this would lead to Mystery Lake. If not, travel to Ravine. Yes, please. Let's do that. Let's travel to the Ravine. Um, so is... No, wait. This is something different. Uh-huh. I think the Ravine might actually be between the maps. You know, this, I mean, this looks like a very good separator between maps. This is ginormous. Wow. Okay. Um, the, the ravine is big and scary. Very big and very scary. Um, I don't think I'm supposed to go down here. I wish it was a little bit lighter. What What is the temperature like? Uh, I can't start a fire here. That's fine. Let's just take it slow and see if we can make it over here. Uh, this is scary. Just... Okay. Yeah, I can see how this can potentially kill you if you're not careful. So we're just gonna... I was about to say slowly over there, but I'm just gonna follow that path. Just assuming that nothing falls apart. Okay, so careful. Okay, nice big waterfall. I mean, I feel confident that I could survive with the wa in terms of water over here. We have a nice waterfall there. That water should be clean, probably coming out of the mountain, or at least... I don't think it's melting snow. doesn't look like it's melting here. But this should bring us to Mystery Lake. Um, yes? Travel to Mystery Lake. Yes, let's do that, please. All right, I think... Yeah, we made it. We made it over the ravine to Mystery Lake. And where is... The entry at Mystery Lake. Oh, it's here. I remember being here in an earlier episode. And, you know, of course, it didn't lead anywhere. Where is this? Is this the dam? Oh, yeah. This is the at the dam. Wonderful. Okay. This just made the whole map double the size. 
And I feel very confident of surviving in the future. Okay, cute deer. So, yeah, let's just, you know, keep roaming this area. And you're actually gonna, you know, search for the Carter Hydro Dam. I think they removed... Okay, I can't scavenge that. I think they did remove the wolf being in the dam and scaring you to death, pretty much. I mean, it's... Or at least reduce the chance of it being here. But I'm just gonna, you know, take that chance. Ooh, it's dark. Uh, accelerant cardboard matches. And again, a toke. Um, locker. I might just, you know, look into things and just grab whatever I need. I'm actually just looking for a knife. So... Yeah, my new strategy just might be to look in something and not take it if I don't need it and just put it back and eventually come back to it. Um, okay. This is, yeah, right, this is the big generator room. There's nothing in here, so I don't need to be here. Just like, let's make sure that I'm not missing anything by not walking over here. Could be something on the ground. Just waiting for me to grab it. Ooh, nice little god rise over there. Oh, there's something in the corner. I was not wrong. A bandage. I'm gonna take the bandage. Beef jerky and pinnacle peaches. I'm not gonna check back here. So. Can I jump? Ah, right, I forgot I cannot jump. Interesting, though, that I cannot jump in this game. I don't seem... I seem to be possible to crouch, but no jumping. Fine with me. Okay. I think this is good. There's nothing I can do to get this running. It would be crazy. Maybe in the story mode, though. Which I'm still very, very excited about. How a story would unfold here. Alright, warmer. Good for me. Uh, Yeah, I guess we're just gonna look through the lockers here. In the hopes of finding a knife. Nope, empty. Empty. And a flare. Uh, I took... Yeah, I'm gonna actually take that flare. I used up both of my flares that I had with me for the wolves. Um, yeah, first aid kit. Sewing kit, nah. Don't need that. Bandage, nope. I got enough of those. Uh, Looks like this is good. <laughs> yeah, I don't need any more soda at this point. The stuff people put in there. Oh, a safe! Wonderful. Okay, so the first one seems to be at 25. I guess this is what we're gonna do now. We're gonna crack a safe in the hopes that there is. Alright, 25 is the first one. We're just going to crack a safe in the hopes that there is a gun in there. I mean, why else would you have a little safe other than storing something valuable in it? Oh, okay. Uh, 54, I assume. Oh, and 10. Okay. 25, 54. Okay, 25. Twenty-five, fifty-four, and I think it was ten. Let's go slowly, and it's open. Let's see what's inside. Rifle ammunition, five rounds. Yes, please. Insulated boots. Yes, please. Okay, that was a lucky one. Um. Clothing. Let's put under the insulated boots. 2.2 degrees Celsius warmth bonus. 1.5 degrees Celsius windproof bonus. That's much better than my basic boots. And I'm actually going to... Oh, what is it with the ski jacket? I do got the premium winter coat, so I don't need that. Um, let me just harvest my basic boots. And repair my super insulated boots with that. Wonderful. And also, let's get that. Cloth is easier... Then, you know, to carry them this. Um, yeah, wool socks, whatever, fine. Just 
destroy it. Okay, good. So now let's repair our insulated boots. I'm gonna have to repair my um, insulated boots. Where are they? I'm gonna have to repair my pry bar at one point. That thing is not doing too well with like it's 20%. Cloth and leather. Please don't fail. I don't have a whole lot of leather. Yes, that worked. How much is it? Um, It is at, I guess, 100% at this point. Insulated. Where are they? Premium. Insulated boots. 100%. Yes, 3 degree warmth bonus. We have a 12 degree Celsius warmth bonus. Uh, uh, but we're still encumbered, so let's drink something. Good. We're fine. Uh, we're a little tired, but I think we can make it to another house. We should be fine. There are so many lockers, though, that I want to go through. Let's have a quick look before we head out. Nah, don't need that, don't need that. Got so many wood meshes as well. Who locks an empty locker? I wonder. Summit soda, no thank you. Very good that I brought the pry bar. Don't remember that many closed lockers everywhere. Here. Work boots. Ha. Ah. Uh, I'm gonna put them back. Same with the sewing kit. Good to know we have it here. Lantern fuel. I wish I had a lantern. Then this might be coming handy. Uh, toke. Cute. I think we're good for now. Yeah. I think we did a fantastic job. We found a way over. Oh, and this is not good. This is a little bit cold and windy. Minus 15 degrees Celsius. Should probably not be outside. I think I'm gonna head back and wait for the storm to be over. It's 10 a.m., so we're just gonna hang out a little bit longer inside. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please leave a like. And we're gonna continue when the storm is over. I'm Weasel, I'm out, and I hope to see you around. Bye-bye!